inspection time, standing next to my bunk, sergeant says, Soldier, you call this a bunk? What did they teach you in college? Nothing. What kept me going was after I got out of the army, I was going to travel to Europe and beyond and sow my wild oats, which I couldn't do back in Brooklyn. Get out of the army, London. Oh, Big Ben, Buckingham Palace, London Bridge, oats, nothing. I'm a kid, what do I know from oats? Nothing, nothing. Paris, I get to Paris. Eiffel Tower, and then Eveline. Oh, Eveline, oh, Eveline. We had a wonderful time, especially when Eveline introduced me to her girlfriend. Oh, wow. <laughs> wild, absolutely wild. On from Paris to Rome. Didn't spend too much time in the Vatican because I met Teresa. Not Teresa, but Teresa. <laughs> Didn't learn too much Italian, but boy, did I get an education. <laughs> well, phenomenal. I was cool. From Rome, Tel Aviv. I was so cool. I get myself a Vespa. I'm riding around on the Vespa. And I begin to scratch and itch and itch. A little bit of itch. But, you know, it's because of this Vespa stuff and whatnot. And <laughs> next day, I look in the shower, and I look in there, and I say, oh, my God. Uh-oh. Now, in Tel Aviv, all the doctors have their specialty on their shingles. And I'm riding around, urologist, that's the guy I need, Dr. Weisman. Walk in, Dr. Weisman, very, very Germanic manner, voice, where are you from? I'm from the United States. Hmm. Let me examine you. Examines me. Hmm. Where have you been? Well, I was in London. What happened in London? Nothing, absolutely nothing happened in London. Where were you next? Paris. What happened in Paris? Well, in Paris, and I go, and he asks me questions. Every little detail, every little detail, probing, every answer probing exactly what happened, what happened. I, I was too embarrassed to ask myself these questions. But he's asked me every little question, every detail he wants to know. And from Paris? Rome. What happened to Rome? Oh, my goodness. What happened in Rome? What happened in Rome? Rome? I finally, I said to him, Doctor, Doctor, what is it? What is syphilis, gonorrhea, what is it? He says, no. He says, it's Miliopris rupa. What, what is that, Miliopris rupa? What is it? What is the prognosis? What's the cure? What is it? He says, Miliopris, it's pimples, rupa, red. red. I said, no, it's red pimples. Well, what is red pimples? What is it? He says, well... My friend from America, you've got prickly heat. You're not used to the heat. 